Osan's 51st Fighter Wing is hosting some of the world's top scientists during a joint field study by NASA and the National Institute of Environmental Research, called Korea-U.S. Air Quality, or Corus aq The goal of the study will advance the ability to monitor air pollution more accurately from space. Well, NASA is very interested in using space as a vantage point for looking back at Earth and understanding the different th things that we need to look at. And air quality is one of them that we're just beginning to learn how to do well. By flying aircraft at many altitudes in concert with ground measurements and computer simulations, we begin to provide a framework where the interpretation of those satellite observations becomes more powerful. Corus AQ will collect air quality data over South Korea for about a month, with both U.S. and South Korean aircraft conducting flights out of Osan Air Base. It's a great opportunity. I mean, we you know, to work with the, with the Koreans and study some of the issues they're having here with their air quality and for us to learn at the same time and you know, help, the, help the future generations and hopefully you know, make the world a better place for us. The groundbreaking partnership will deepen the understanding of controlling air quality and to use this joint effort to make the world a better place for generations to come. Air Force Staff Sergeant Darren Murphy, Osan Air Base, Korea.